Another Moment in Blues History, presented by Just Blues Music Foundation. Blues is calling my name. New Orleans may be best known for its brass bands, second line parades, and rich jazz history, but the city also has a resonant R&B and blues piano tradition. James Booker is one of the most iconic figures in this legacy. Born in 1939, he was the son of a Baptist minister. Early on, he absorbed music ranging from classical organ and piano through jazz to blues, pop, and rock and roll. That eclecticism characterized his music from then on. Even in a city famous for its boundary-shattering musical adventurousness, Booker's dexterity and repertoire stood out. A typical performance might include hard-edged R&B street anthems, blues ballads, pop standards, and classical numbers by the likes of Bach or Chopin. His spellbinding technique was matched only by the depth of spirit he brought to his playing. In the 70s, he toured and recorded with world-famous rock stars, expanding his listenership and his fame but his heart was always in the timeless, living tradition of his home city. Dubbed the Black Liberace for his onstage flamboyance and peerless musical acumen, James Booker was, and is, one of the giants of blues history. This has been another moment in blues history, presented by Just Blues Music Foundation. Blues is calling my name.